today we're going to take you for a walk through this Makara Gen 3 10 meter inboard. The owners really spec it well. He's going to use it as a bit of a caravan on the water. Trips to Fiordland, game fishing, Waihau Bay, Three Kings. He plans to go everywhere on it. Hi, I'm Alan Shaw from Makara Boats. Today we're going to take you for a walk through this Makara Boats Gen 3 10 meter inboard diesel. It's a really well appointed boat. The owner's done a really nice job of specking it. It's a bit of a caravan on the water, so it really ticks a lot of boxes. So in the new 10 meter Gen 3, we have changed the transom layout. So now we run tuna tubes on both sides of the boat. So there's built-in aluminium tuna tubes on either side. Doesn't matter what side your fish comes up on, you've always got a live bait to throw it. And we've increased the size of our live bait tank to 140 litres. It's a nice big radius corner tank. This boat has a gas bottle locker, so you can put your barbecue on the bait board. Also, we've got rear facing cockpit seat. You can get two people on there. It also fits a 75 litre Waco bin under there. In the Gen 3, we've changed the rocket launcher design. So uh, we no longer run a wing. You can reach the rod holders, which believe it or not is actually not a very common thing in most aluminium hardtop boats. This owner has got a height restriction on his garage, so all the radar, FLIR camera folds into the cockpit and it's fully game rigged. So this is powered by a Volvo D6 380. Does 35 knots, heavy with 5 POV. Burns about 1.6 to 2 litres of nautical mile depending on speed. It trolls for about 5 litres an hour at 7.5 knots. This owner's opted to have a second station in the cockpit. It's really handy for when you're fighting fish or you're fishing, deep dropping, even if you're salmon fishing. Having the controls here in the cockpit is a really good feature. The Volvo inboard diesels with the DPI leg have a low speed mode, so when you're activating low speed mode, the boat does about one and a half to two knots in gear. So it means you don't kill live baits, you control for salmon. It's a really good feature. Even at the marina, you can go really slow. You're not in gear doing four and a half knots. Uh, it's got a small Volvo screen there that also has your sounder on it as well. So really neat feature. Bow thrust to control, USB charge port. So yeah, really tidy setup to have in the cockpit. Like all of our bigger boats, they come with uh, bifold doors and drop down pillarless window. So a really nice feature. It gives you indoor outdoor flow throughout the boat. People can be sitting inside. They're involved in what's happening out the back if they're not fishing. You can come in here, get out the sun, get out the weather. Really comfortable. Cold days, you can shut the whole thing right up. This has got a nice oak cabinet. It's got a Wallace cooktop and a Wallace diesel heater in the boat as well. So that vents onto the front windscreen, so it's just like your car. Get up in the morning, you've got a fogged up windscreen, you can turn the diesel heater on and it will defog your, all your windows. So this owner has option to have a large locker under floor. So you can see here how much storage he has in the boat. Um, you can fill it up with gear, dive bottles, whatever you want. And like all of our 950s and 10 meters, this boat also has the under berth underneath the seating. So this owner has optioned uh, twin 16 inch screens, uh, standard switch panels, got zip weight 450 tabs, and a Garmin VHF. It's a really nice, nice package. All the dash in this boat is Italian leather, so is the seating. So really comfortable knee roll cushions. So this boat sleeps six people. It has a full head on the port side and four bunks in the forward cabin, two people in the under berth. Um, one of the features of our boats, which isn't very common, this is still a trailer boat, but you can stand up in the forward cabin. So I'm six foot one and I can stand up in the forward cab, straight legged. So same with all our bunks here, two meter bunks, really built for comfort. They're nice and wide. Like all Makaras, this has got an 8 mil hull bottom. It's got really good fuel economy, about 1.8 litres per nautical mile at cruise. And it's got the new Gen 3 hull, which has the Carolina Flare. Really soft, dry ride. This is the biggest trailer boat in our range. So at 10 metres, it weighs about 5.5 tonne. 
and can be towed behind most American trucks. If you'd like any more information about this boat or any of the other boats in our range, send us an email to sales at and we'll get back to you with more info.